We're back looking again at the bottom of the half guard using the seatbelt grip and what to do when a partner has a really strong whizzer. We're not able to get to our main technique, which is usually initially the double leg from the bottom. It's a good solid reversal. So what do we do? Well, we're on the bottom here and our partner is on the top. We have the underhook in place. Our partner has the whizzer grip. From here, we have a seatbelt. We're gonna to look to generate a little bit of move, uh, movement and motion to get our body low. We're gonna take our elbow onto the floor. We're gonna prop ourselves up. And from here, usually we're looking to start some sort of action where we're switching the legs and coming up to our knees and driving. So initially, we start by trapping our partner's leg, climbing up and either taking our leg all the way out, or you can often sweep your leg out in this fashion. As we go to drive across, we feel that our partner is putting a lot of pressure down here, rotate slightly, which is what you should expect your partner to be whizzering here. We're gonna keep the elbow propped. We're gonna take our arm from around our partner's waist. Scoot back a little bit, please. So when your arm is around your partner's waist here, it gives him a good purchase for the whizzer. We're gonna take our arm to the near side. So as he dips his shoulder down, we're gonna take the arm to the inside position. Now with a loose arm, we can throw our left shoulder forward, our inside shoulder forward, take our arm out, and take our own position on the back here. Now from here, it's up to you how you go on the attack, dip the knee, and then begin to expose your partner's back and put your hooks in. So, opposite angle here, bottom half, number one, underhook, switch the feet, prop up, and we're working our way around the corner here. We have this deep grip, that's allowing our partner to keep their whizzer solid and drive into us. So we're still gonna get up off our hip to our knees. Now we're in this side-by-side -side position, often called the dog fight position, really it's just a whizzer and a seat belt, one against one. And as he goes to drive here, as much as we might want to push across, we feel that it's too intimidating and our partner's too strong. So we're going to take the arm to the inside position. We're going to take the arm to the inside position here, and we're going to throw our arm forward here. So the direction he's driving, this way, that's where we take our arm. We're going to take it out, up, and over. Now from here, you're on your partner's back. Whether you choose to attack right from here, or as we usually favor, dip the knee, place the hook on the inside, and go to work, it's up to you. So this method takes care of the biggest problem from the bottom of half guard when you have the seatbelt, and that's the whizzer. Stronger person, bigger person, putting a lot of pressure. The key is just get that arm out of there. Once you do that, you've got free reign. You can even take your partners back. At the very least, you've alleviated some of that pressure, created another transition, and you're going to be able to move from there. Hopefully this was helpful for you. Thanks for watching.